This is a question about the advantages of genetically engineered insulin. So it says, until the 1980s, all insulin used to treat diabetes was obtained from animals such as pigs and cattle. In the 1980s, the human insulin gene was introduced into bacteria and insulin is now produced by genetically engineered bacteria. Describe the advantage of using genetically engineered insulin. So this is insulin that will be human insulin. And we'll talk about the advantage of using human insulin over insulin that's taken from pigs and cattle after slaughter. So the first thing is with human insulin, you get a more rapid response. That's because insulin from cattle is slightly different. You also get a shorter duration of response. Once insulin has been released and your blood sugar has gone back to normal, you want the response to stop. With human insulin, that duration that's lasting for much quicker to stop. With cattle, the duration lasts a lot longer, which is, is going to be a risky blood sugar going too low. There's also less chance of an immune response. To the insulin. So people might develop a tolerance to animal insulin. So they just stop, the body stop reacting to it. There's also the sensitive issue, the ethical of cattle slaughter. Okay, so the cattle being killed. Because we're using bacteria, it's cheaper and easier to produce human insulin. It's easier to produce human insulin in large amounts because you're using bacteria with very cheap um, sources to start off. And there's also less chance of infection from animal to human. So there's nine suitable responses to this question for the advantages of using genetic engineered insulin and the examiners are after free.